GPR stands for Ground Penetrating Radar. GPR's main use is locating utilities underground. So for finding any underground infrastructure, pipelines or sewers or anything like that, GPR is very useful. You can also use it in archaeology to find disturbances in the ground or previous foundations. The GPR is approved by Industry Canada. It's a shielded antenna. Or we're using the same frequencies as FM radio. It's not a new technology, it's been around for a while, but it's new to the world of drones. Traditionally, you would have the GPR to a cart to push it through a field. That leads to the issue of inaccessibility where you can't get a cart to. Drone GPR is safer. You don't put the operator at risk anymore. You're not pushing a cart through dangerous terrain and you can access areas that you can't normally access with a cart. Things like lawn grass, crop fields, ice or water, any kind of uneven surface we can fly over where you couldn't normally push a cart. You can do things faster and safer than before. We can pre-program a flight from the office, come out in the field, launch a drone. This altimeter actually keeps the drone's altitude within a meter of the ground and it can follow the curves and contours of the ground. Our scan lines can be consistent and evenly spaced and once we pinpoint an area of interest then we can move in with the ground-based method and do much tighter scans. Once the scan data has been collected out in the field, we build what's approximating a 3D model of the infrastructure on the ground. It is slices of the ground and the bounces from the objects on the ground. And from there, you interpret that into whether it's a pipe, whether it's a rock, it's a soil compaction from the surroundings. It is one of the few tools that we have uh, to give us an idea of what could be on the ground without actual digging. With our experience in acquiring, analyzing, and interpreting GPR data, we can give our customers a good understanding of what may be on the ground uh, to ensure that uh, their project is a success.